Hi, I'm Erica from Inumi, and we're at Lollapalooza Festival with The Regrets. How Hello, are you? So Hi, good. How good. Are you? Amazing. Enjoying this cool weather today. So nice out. How has your Lala experience been thus far? This well, is it. Yeah, yeah, we just got here recently, so we had some banging breakfast, and now we're now we're here. That's what's it. up. So you had a show last night. I saw some clips. I saw some jumping into the crowd. I saw some maybe jumping onto the bar. How was it? Yes, yes, it was so fun. It was so, those like late night shows you always think are gonna be really hard to get through and then you get that second wind of energy and then it's just so, you're like delirious enough to make it extra fun. <laughs> so I've seen you play in NYC and you had that epic show last night in Chicago. I'm wondering, I've been talking to a lot of bands about this. Do you feel like Chicago crowds are different than other crowds? Like, what? how are they when it comes to reacting to your music as music lovers? I feel like Chicago crowds are always really awesome. Yeah. I feel like every show we've played here has always been really, really fun. Like, more fun than a lot of New York crowds, honestly. Yeah, I feel like everyone's really nice and really into it. Down to get down. Yeah. <laughs> down to get down. You hear that, New York? Step it up. <laughs> get down to get down. So <laughs> back in 2018, we're going to throw it back a little bit. One of my first festival interviews was with The Regrets here at Lollapalooza. Oh, my God. I remember that. It was so fun. That was so crazy. Whoa. So that okay. Was, that's where we that's where we've met you before. Damn. That was wild. a good time. We were like sitting in the grass, I believe. It was a very yeah. chill chat. It was Aww. very fun. But just coming back here at Lollapalooza after all this time, not only Dude. growing your fan base, but growing as artists. How Humans. is it to be back? It's honestly a trip. It feels very full circle in a lot of ways. It feels, I feel really proud of what we've accomplished in that amount of time and who we are as musicians and artists now. It's crazy. It's I feel like I was a little kid yeah. the last time we were here, honestly. Super fun to be back. This is my first back. time, so I'm just excited to be here. <laughs> Hell yeah. Always excited to be at Lollapalooza. So I caught you back at Coachella. Now we're here at Lollapalooza. I feel like we're just going to hit up all the huge festivals. Yes. Do you have a favorite festival? Not just as performers, but as just like music lovers. If you were giving out a must go to festival list, what would the top one be? Any country, any festival. Glastonbury was really cool. Yes, Glastonbury for sure. Yeah. I want to go back so bad. That one. That's the one. I feel like growing up in L.A., honestly, Coachella for me is so like was just always the biggest deal and it is, it feels like such a big deal when you're there and there's something that's really special about that but also something that makes it a little less fun so I don't know it's like a mixed thing where I think Coachella but also Lala is probably my favorite festival to be honest this is this festival just is so special to me yeah so many good festivals those are definitely my top three so speaking of Coachella that was right around the time that you released Further Joy how has it been since the release of the album? It's such a like joyful but cathartic and raw and honest album to play that for fans live. How has the experience been? So fun. That's been a great time. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's been, been amazing. amazing, honestly. It's been um, just really special to, I mean, I can't get over people singing the lyrics. Like it's still, especially on this album, there's something that feels really crazy about that. Um, like you said, it's a very, it's just a super vulnerable album, so it just feels really good um, to get it all out there. Yeah. So before we go and allow you to enjoy the rest of your festival day, I have to know, is there anything that you want to drop with fans, anything that you're excited to do next that you want to let everyone know about? Hopefully putting out some new music pretty soon sooner than you may think. Mm -hmm. mm. That's right. Intriguing. Yeah, sure. That's always great news. Well, thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you. Thank you. Can't wait to catch your set later. Thank and you we'll so talk much. to you soon, I'm sure. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. All right.